Where to stay in Fort Lauderdale is a question asked by many looking for a relaxing beach vacation, enjoying the sun and palm trees of South Florida. One of the most populous cities in Florida, located less than 30 miles north of Miami, it has a wide range of options suitable for all types of travelers. That's why we're now going to take you through the best areas to stay in Fort Lauderdale. This will include things like cultural attractions, sandy beaches, restaurants, and some of the best hotels in Fort Lauderdale. This ensures you can pick the perfect place to stay in Fort Lauderdale. We begin a search in the city center, the unofficial downtown Fort Lauderdale, Las Olas. The area is centered around Las Olas Boulevard, which runs from Las Olas Beach on the coast to the wharf Fort Lauderdale, an outdoor plaza filled with food vendors, bars, music, and vibrant atmosphere. Las Olas Boulevard is filled with all the amenities you would expect to find in downtown Fort Lauderdale. Bars, restaurants, nightclubs, shops, boutiques, and some of the best hotels in Fort Lauderdale are walking distance apart and cater to your every need, both night and day. We move now from the most popular part of the inner city to the central beach resort of Fort Lauderdale, Fort Lauderdale Beach. The main selling point of Fort Lauderdale Beach is that it features an incredible seven-mile-long beach of beautiful golden sand. With Fort Lauderdale Beach having such an incredible expanse of beach, there are parts guaranteed to please everyone. Lauderdale by the Sea is situated in the far north of Fort Lauderdale, where the city borders that of Pompano Beach. Lauderdale by the Sea is a small village covering roughly six blocks that is located entirely on a long, narrow barrier island. Lauderdale by the Sea is best known for its fishing and marine life. Anglin's Fishing Pier is found in the east and named after the town's first mayor. This is the perfect spot for any anglers who are in town looking to add their own name to the record books. Our next destination of Wilton Manors is located just to the south of Lauderdale by the Sea. This is an area that has developed a reputation as one of the primary hubs for Florida's LGBT community. In fact, it is recorded as having the second highest percentage of same-sex couples, compared to overall population anywhere in the country. As a result, it has blossomed into a tourist destination for those in the community, as they feel safer and better catered to here. Never is this true than in the heart of Wilton Manors, which centers around Wilton Drive. The Imperial Point neighborhood is located in the very north of Fort Lauderdale. A primarily residential neighborhood, it is full of modern, middle-class residences that are home to a thriving local community. A great range of shops, bars and restaurants provide a great range of everything you could need to ensure you have a pleasant stay. As a less popular area with tourists, you will also find these establishments considerably quieter than in more common tourist hotspots. Pensetia Heights is an inland neighborhood, located in the northeast section of Fort Lauderdale. Originally known as North Ridge, it was founded to create new housing in the aftermath of World War II. Surrounded to the north and east by the Middle River, it is a beautiful place to take a stroll and enjoy the area's fabulous weather, without being surrounded by mobs of tourists. Our penultimate destination is a pair of neighborhoods found in the very south of Fort Lauderdale. We'll begin in Harbordale, which is the slightly more inland of the two, and centers primarily around the Browood Convention Center. With its stunning glass atrium providing stunning views of the river, as well as statues and fountains, it is a truly stunning place to visit. Home to many of the largest conventions and exhibitions in Fort Lauderdale, it makes Harbordale the ideal place to stay for anyone attending an event here. Our final stop of Hollywood Beach isn't actually located within the city limits of Fort Lauderdale. It is instead in the city of Hollywood, which is located within the greater Fort Lauderdale area. Hollywood Beach is best described as Florida's answer to the legendary Venice Beach out in Los Angeles. Long, wide stretches of soft, white sand sprawl for what seems like forever. Filled with beach chairs it is the perfect place to relax in the sun, people watching or enjoying the view, and sound of the turquoise ocean rolling up the shore. Fort Lauderdale is easily one of the best cities in South Florida, and perhaps even in the entire state. Whether you prioritize a beach, spa, days shopping, great restaurants and hotels, or simply the best location to relax in the sun, Fort Lauderdale will have an option to keep you happy. This video should have given you all the information you need to decide where to stay in Fort Lauderdale to achieve your dream vacation. All that's left is to get everything booked so you can find the best value deal and get prepared for your very own stay in Fort Lauderdale.